Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video I want to show you the update of my previous tutorial about the nested cables in geometry nodes to show you how to change the actual group node that I created using a duplication 10 times of this group node and that we can replace with the new repeat zone of geometry nodes. So instead of using these 10 group nodes and 10 times this join geometry we can use the new repeat zone here we can link in the input of this uh, repeat zone all the information that we need for the first group node so the resolution so i can link these to the input this big radius uh, creating a dot the small radius uh, again here with uh, a linking of the small radius uh, the profile resolution and next uh, we need to use the layer the layering so in this way we can adjust and manipulate the limit of the layering that we want for each curve that we need so in this case we can duplicate this group node so the creation of the cables shift d link here we can rename the attribute as we need resolution big radius small radius and profile resolution it's okay we need also the layer and we can drag directly to the input here now for the layering we can link these to the group input of our group node the general group node and to do this i press ctrl h to see all the attributes and link the layer here but not using this attribute as the layer but as the iterations of our repeat zone because we we don't want to use this uh, value as the layer of the group node cables from a small big radius because we want to iterate each time adding from the layer the value of one and i will explain this behavior linking this result here for the next layer and so on for the total number of iterations that we set from this layer group input so the logic here is this i start with zero value in the first iteration of this repeat zone this value goes inside the first cables from a small big radius group node and the result it's the same as this group node with the zero as the layer next in the parallel way we add one to this zero value equal one and we can use this as the output or input of the next iteration so the equivalent of this group node with the layer one so in this way i can link the resolution here the big radius the small radius the profile resolution the same for the output or the input of the next generation of cables layer the big the small radius we can link directly the profile resolution between these two nodes because also in this way you can see the linking of the profile resolution of the group input the base group input of the node in geometry nodes inside all the single group node here press tab to exit from this group node and here we have the limit of the layers that we need we can set 10 the old value tab to enter in this group node we can rename these as layers and finally as we see here for these nodes we have a joint geometry from the output of each group node with the previous so we need to press shift ctrl and drag these two nodes to have the join geometry and to have this result as the new output or the new input of the next iteration and after all the iterations we set here we have the correct geometry output that we can link directly here and you can see for this curve nothing changes because if i press tab this is the global group node used for this Bezier curve and in this case we can limit the number of layers we can use you can see two layers three four or five and the same for this curve i can select these and increase the number of layers we can or won't use inside our geometry node system and in this case i can press tab and delete all these nodes here now the setup is uh, more easy to understand and easy to manipulate we can select all the repeat zone move 
here a little bit press ctrl h and this is the final result of the replacing thank you guys for watching this uh, new update you will find uh, in my gumroad page uh, the previous version and this new version for blender 4 in this way you can download the previous version or the new version you need if you like my video please check like and subscribe to my channel and see you to the next tutorial bye